What's up guys? It's your girl TT with Off The Eats and welcome back to my channel. I have been on vacation for almost two weeks so I haven't posted anything but I am here today and I got some wing stop. I didn't get like a whole bunch. Uh, of course I got some stuff for the kids and I stole a roll from them. Got some carrots. I'm gonna show y'all in a minute. General hiding back behind here. I got some carrots that I'm gonna eat. And I got me some french fries. Oh my god, you know what? I don't have any ketchup. For my carrots. And I got eight wings. I got four and four since I could uh, split up the flavors. I got four uh, Parmesan and then four of the Atomic Bomb. So I'm going to give me some ketchup. I'll be right back. All right, y'all. I got my ketchup. Woo! So let's eat. I love me some carrots. It did come with some celery too. I gave the celery to the kids because they, oh shoot, they love, they love celery and I love carrots. This ranch sauce from Wingsop. It's fire. With the kids on spring break. And we had so much fun. We went down to Miami, we went to Miami port and took a cruise ship to Jamaica, Ocho Rios, Jamaica and Cayman Islands, which was Grand Cayman. And honey, when I tell you Grand Cayman's ocean water in the sand it was everything the sand was just like really really soft and um I don't know the ocean water it was just so pretty but it was very deep that was one thing I did notice I mean as soon as you get out into that water it's coming up by your neck But one thing I can say I enjoyed the most, being in Grand Cayman, was like little to no hassle. Um, we took a bus to the beach, and sorry, like dipping my my Parmesan wings in the ranch sauce. We took a bus to the beach. It was like six dollars, which was super cheap. And there wasn't like, you know, anybody coming up to you trying to sell you stuff. And you got a chance, you know, just lay there and tan and relax. They had one little food area. They made uh, Jamaican jerk chicken with rice and beans. And then they had a uh, rum punch. Mm -mm -mm. Is all I got to say. When I tell you that jerk chicken was seasoned, baby, it was seasoned. And the rice and beans was fire. It was just so good. It wasn't dry or anything. You know, sometimes people can grill chicken and they can overcook it and they can get a little dry. It wasn't dry at all. 
the kids had a really good time though i'm glad that they enjoyed themselves y'all this roll look at that i mean it's got to be butter but oh my god look at it it is so freaking good why is wing stop so good They chicken don't be like all soggy and stuff. Or even dry. I made a mess too. I have to clean it up. So I got Parmesan. And then I got the Atomic Bomb. Oh, these are spicy. Mm. These are so good. They definitely are spicy though. I'm trying to remember. If the atomic is at the hottest on the list, it probably is. I mean, how hot, hotter can you get besides atomic? And then y'all probably like, why don't she just put the chicken up to her mouth and just eat it that way? I do sometimes, but I like taking my finger and breaking it apart. Don't judge me. But y'all, when we went to Jamaica, Ocho Rios, Man, Let's get they let the locals come right to like the port area and they have like beautiful, beautiful items for sale. Shirts, shorts, hats, um, statues. Shot glasses, you name it, they got it. It was just a lot of them though there. It was like a tent, like lined up in a circle. And everybody has something to sell. Now, do y'all ever dip y'all fries into the ranch sauce? Cause I do, sometimes. Try a little bit of everything. Bill. Probably was here for a couple minutes. These are so spicy, but I love the spice. Love it, love it, love it.
but yeah y'all so and um ultra rios right by the ship there's an area called uh margaritaville and you know they have like little shops and stuff you can go in there and buy stuff and then they also had a margaritaville where it was like food they had a pool there um drinks and um we ended up buying like beach chairs and umbrella and stuff like that so the kids can play in the ocean over there we didn't drive at Ontario rios to another beach because literally yeah i think we had like four hours probably even five like off the ship and we had to be back at a certain time so we didn't want to risk uh getting back late but we still had like such an amazing time and they even had a like a water trampoline out in the ocean kind of by by kind of by the beach area it's have fun with that as well actually <laughs> i have fun myself Y'all, these Parmesan wings be busting, busting. Those are like my favorite wings to order from Wingstop. y'all let's dip it dip baby dip I don't know if y'all know this thing here, no napkins. And I don't even feel like getting up and getting them. All right, it's Parmesan City up in here. Hmm. Oh yeah, totally forgot to tell you guys. Um, went on a boat ride as well when we were in Margaritaville. We were hanging out at the beach. Then we uh, swim up to that water trampoline. And at first it was like just me and my family on a trampoline. And uh, this girl came over by herself. And then all of a sudden her friend came over, probably like after 30 minutes of us being there. And so, like I said, the guys came up with the boat and they was like, you know, do you guys want to go on a boat ride? Blah, blah, blah. You know, they was talking a certain amount. We uh, didn't agree with the amount. So they were like, OK, if you get this, however many people or this amount of people, then we'll lower the price. So we like, cool. They wanted like 12 people. And I think it ended up being like 10 or 11 of us total. Like we was just grabbing <laughs> like everybody. What was funny? This is what was funny. It ended up being like all black people and the people who had the boat, they thought that we were all family. So it just kind of worked out that way because he was asking, he was like, are y'all family? And even the other girls, they were like, yeah, like we're all together. And we did not know each other at all. You know, it was just me and uh, my wife and the two boys or two kids. So it was just the four of us. And then the rest of them, I think it was like two separate people. Then nobody didn't know each other, but long story short, we had an amazing time on the boat and omg we pulled over we took the boat to another dock 
and one of the guys got off the boat grabbed like this humongous speaker put it on the boat connect his bluetooth on his phone to the speaker and we're like oh yeah we about to kick it he playing megan the stallion he playing cardi b you know we on the boat turning up then all of a sudden we start speeding past this other boat the other boat they was going in it was like two guys on the boat and somebody was driving it and the boat was like sideways like that's how fast they were going and turning it was like kind of crazy but anyway uh they drove past us all of a sudden we hit like this big wave and when i tell you so much water splashed onto the boat and it splashed right onto the fucking speaker oh my god when i tell you we was kicking and dancing then that water came came up on that speaker that speaker said er, turn completely off never came back on uh the guy had to tilt it over you know to let the water out that baby did not come back on at all at all i know i know he was devastated first of all why didn't he have like some kind of like waterproof speaker or you know just something i'm sure they got them out by now you know big speakers with something to where they can cover for the water but i mean after that it got quiet for a few minutes <laughs> and then we ended up like heading back like i said we still had an amazing time on the boat but when that water hit that speaker it just kind of killed like everybody's vibe and everything and we were just trying to figure out like what the hell happened everything just happened so fast and you know when nobody like super drunk or anything on a boat or at least as far as i know everybody seemed you know fine but you, i mean even if they were drunk it don't matter i mean we on vacation but we had a good time i would do it again probably bring my myself a speaker maybe <laughs> like a little handheld one to listen to some music oh this wing is hot it's getting hot All right, it's my last hot wing. Let me ask y'all a question. <laughs> do you, some of y'all suck like all the meat off the bone? Like, do you put the chicken in your mouth and just <laughs> I'm pretty sure I've done that a couple times. It just depends on the chicken. But I feel like I do be wasting some of the meat that's on the chicken. I just don't be wanting to eat it. This is a good snack. Just carrots and ranch. All right, guys, if you haven't already, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel because it's not mine. I say ours because my youngest son loves to do videos with me. So, so I do appreciate the ones who have subscribed and I will see you guys on the next video.